Taipei. I'm here at Food Taipei. This is one of the biggest food shows here in East Asia. They have food from actually all over the world here today, but we're going to focus on Asia, try some different unique things. So let's eat. All right, in the in the in the tofu lineup, tofu that is tofu lineup. Oh, thank you. What? Oh, it's kind of soft. Oh, 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 you know, but with this type of stuff, there's not a whole lot of flavor, so you gotta put stuff in it, but they just, it's just to taste the tofu itself and the texture, but really delicious. Great texture, my, my fingers are burning right now. Oh, 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 this is it. <laughs> okay, so we're trying, it's a, a very fine uh, pickled uh, vegetable company here, and they, they do the bamboo, and I'm trying the pickled bamboo right now. Really good. So that stuff's great. You can, I mean, you'll find that, I think, in a lot of uh, different markets, the pickled uh, bamboo. And uh, great with noodles or something. Gives it a lot of flavor. You just have a real simple dish with some veggies and uh, pickled bamboo. So good. Mm. Now, this is un unusual. I've never seen this before. It's called red yeast rice noodles. So they're kind of a red, pinkish color. Let's see if they taste any different than just regular rice noodles. So yeah, a little uh, great. They taste great. A little nuttier flavor to them. And uh, red yeast rice noodles. Good. So this is a great food, especially if you're vegetarian or vegan. And that's why actually Taipei has uh, been voted the number one vegan city in Asia because of all of the uh, vegetarian products that you can get here and vegetarian restaurants. So this type of a gluten is um, very delicious, a great flavoring agent for things. And uh, so you can throw this in noodles or rice with your vegetables, have a nice real Asian, authentic Asian uh, flavored dish. So let me give it a try. This is what it looks like right here. Mm. So a little bit of you know sweet sour going on, and great for flavoring stuff. So this is seasoned squid. Oh, that's good. Wasabi flavored, okay. And then this is conch. Spicy conch. Thank you. And we have some surf surf clam meat. This is all Taiwan seafood. Taiwan? Yes. Taiwan. Taiwan. Yeah. Oh, I'll try that. Thank you. So we got the seasoned capelin roll, masago orange. And this is crawfish salad. Crawfish salad. Look at all of this. Amazing. Uh, okay, I'll try this. Okay, this is my score here. And uh, Taiwan seafood is really amazing. So I'm going to try some of these delicacies. I just tried the conch and it's really good. It's a, a, a little bit of a, a chewier texture to it. And what they've got it in is a nice, got a nice little uh, kick to it. The spiciness in the uh, sauce of the conch is quite good. And uh, what else have we got here? Let's try some of the, the fish roe. Cheers. Spilling some of my shirt. Um, yeah, it's wonderful. My really delicate uh, fish uh, uh, egg taste to it. And you, of course, you probably see that on a lot of uh, sushi and sushi rolls, uh, nigiri here, and onigiri. And then I'm gonna try the seasoned squid with uh, wasabi. With a little bit of fish egg on it, there we go. Oh, that's nice. And, um, Definitely has that squid flavor to it with uh, some uh, seaweed and a little bit of a sweetness as well. Sweetness with the wasabi. Delicious. It's Mr. Brown. 
Hello, Mr. Brown. Ni hao. Mr. Brown coffee. So, what am I trying here? This one is cherry. 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 Yeah. Yes. Okay, this is cherry. Inside is juice and outside is seaweed. Oh, seaweed. Yes. There's seaweed in this yes. and cherry. Yes. Okay, very unique. Thank you. Cherry. Cheers. This is a, 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 a flavoring you use in drinks, right? You use it in drinks and desserts. Desserts and drinks. And, and ice, ice desserts, yes. Of course, of course. Cheers, bottoms up. Seaweed and cherry with the bubbles. Actually, I love the, I love the bubbles inside. Let's go. Oh, that's good. I love the bubbles. It's nice. Cheers, 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 cheers. This is basically just green pea. And let me give it a try. Green pea on a stick. That's it. It's really good. Really just, you know, green pea tasting, but, you know, fresh tasting. And I can see how this could be a great snack while you're drinking beer or something. Okay, we're gonna try some, uh, this is just passion fruit juice. Passion fruit juice, Ooh. Passion fruit, spilling everything here, clots. Passion fruit juice, a little bit of orange mixed in, all from uh, Taiwan, Gambe. Good, and not too sweet, perfect. This is sweet potato. Yeah. Sweet potato. sweet potato pie. This is not the sweet potato pie from the southern United States. This is the Asian style or Taiwanese style. This is from Taiwan. Yes, yes. Thank you. Very delicious. Just want me to be sure it's, to say it's from Taiwan. Taiwan, the best. Boy, that was good. The um, crust was kind of flaky. Potatoes, just perfect. Mm, I'm going for more. French fries, why not? Good, good texture. What else can you say? They're french fries, not too salty. Okay, now we're trying sweet preserved tofu. We've got to get into the exotic stuff here. French fries, this other stuff. We've got to, this is Taiwan, we've got to try different stuff here. This, this is a sweet tofu, basically, that's uh, preserved in a jar. Oh, that looks good. It's so good. It's silky, like a really soft texture. It's like cheese. Yeah, yeah, delicious. Oh my, that's so good. Wow. If you like, you can take it. Oh, thank you. That's so kind. For giving me a jar of the sweet, sweet um, bean curd. And uh, you know, it's uh, it's sold in Indonesia, Thailand, but they're not selling it in uh, Taiwan. Not as much of a demand. Oh, that, that's so nice. And here's the brand. So if you're ever in the United States, Indonesia, or Thailand, you pick this up. Delicious. Oh, it's here, it's here. So, here we go. The giant... I, actually, I, I know I'm going to like this because I've had lots of these before, but I'm trying this for you. This is great. And I'll have these with beer anytime. It's got a, actually a delicate taste to it. It's not really super like prawn or shrimp flavor, just sort of a delicate flavor to it. Cute food from Taiwan. These are marshmallows, like ghosts. These are like ghost marshmallows. Okay, thank you. One more? May I try one more? Okay, I'm gonna try one. Not exactly exotic, but kind of cute. Ghost eater.
Hey, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed that, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. There's lots more stuff to watch from Taiwan, East Asia, and Southeast Asia, and South Asia. But for now, this is John Sabo. More to explore. See you next time.